Good morning to former Kentucky Wildcat Dwayne Casey coached the Toronto Raptors to the most successful season in franchise history this year. And when you perform, you get paid. Casey and the Raptors agreed to a three year extension worth $18 million in his five seasons in Toronto. Casey has won more games each season, 23 in year one and then 34, 48, 49, and then of course 56 this year. Charles Matthews looks like he may be going to either Michigan or Xavier. This comes from a report by ESPN.com's Jeff Goodman. Matthews played in all 36 games this past season. Michigan lost in the first round of the NCAA tournament. Xavier lost to Wisconsin in the second round of the NCAA tournament. Well, officials with the Kentucky High School Basketball Hall of Fame took a visit to Knott County yesterday afternoon. Former Heinemann head coach Pearl Combs will be inducted later this summer in Elizabethtown. Three of Combs' former players gathered at the old Heinemann gym to talk about their coach. Danny Terry talked about what Combs might have had to say about being inducted into the Hall of Fame. Probably wouldn't care how he was remembered because he knew what he was. He knew what he wanted to be. He was silent in the community. He kept his nose out of other people's business. But, but then again, Pearl's like everybody. Everybody wants something good to be said about him. And I have nothing but good things to say about Coach Pearl Combs. Other members of the 2016 Hall of Fame class include Perry Central Girls head basketball coach Randy Napier, former Hazard star Jim Rose, and Johnson County native Donis Butcher. Game one of the NBA Finals last night, and it's a matchup most NBA fans or just fans of basketball in general wanted. The Cavs and the Warriors. Stephen Curry and Golden State looking to repeat as champions. LeBron James and the Cavs looking to win their first championship. First quarter, Golden State up by two. Curry says, hey, Tristan Thompson, riding your eye hole. How about that? A little later, how about LeBron spinning and winning? Warriors still up by four, 21 to 17. Let's go second quarter. Iggy, 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 can't you see? Sometimes your strips, they hypnotize me. Andre Iguodala strips Kyrie Irving. Clay Thompson finishes on the other end. The Warriors led by nine at the break, and they win it. 104-89, Golden State takes game one from the Cavs. And, of course, next half hour, we're going to show you those 15th region softball championship highlights. You don't want to miss those. Johnson Central and McGuffey County played nine innings of softball to crown a champ. You'll see who's going to Owensboro next half hour. That's a first look at sports this morning. Enjoy your morning.